Psalm 145, Great is the Lord, a song of praise of David. I will extol you, my God and my King, and bless your name forever and ever. And I want to just pause here as I feel the Holy Spirit leading to encourage us, no matter what type of week, day, month, or year you've been in, to praise the Lord for who He is and that for his unfailing love for you, even with all that you've been through, to make a choice this night to praise the Lord with me for who he is. Every day I will bless you and praise your name forever and ever. Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. One generation shall commend your works to another and shall declare your mighty acts. That's encouraging for us to think of that the days that we're walking through right now, we will be able to pass on and speak of the faithfulness and the works of God that he did on our behalf and pass them on to the generations after. On the glorious splendor of your majesty and on your wondrous works, I will meditate They shall speak of the might of your awesome deeds, and I will declare your greatness. They shall pour forth the fame of your abundant goodness, and shall sing aloud of your righteousness. The Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. The Lord is good to all, and his mercy is over all that he has made. All your works shall give thanks to the Lord, To you, O Lord, and all your saints shall bless you. They shall speak of the glory of your kingdom and tell of your power. To make known to the children of man your mighty deeds and the glorious splendor of your kingdom. Your kingdom is an everlasting kingdom, and your dominion endures throughout all generations. And I'm reminded here that we, our job as we do the kingdom work before us, as we bring heaven down to earth and the will of heaven into the earth in the authority of Christ and do the things that he has given us to do, our goal should be to make known the glory of God and of his kingdom in the earth. And remember that his kingdom never ends. It's everlasting and his dominion in the in the earth and in the heavens never ends. And so no matter the disappointments or the battle that we face through the seasons of our lives, we know that the dominion and power of God's kingdom will always endure. The Lord is faithful in all his words and kind in all his works. The Lord upholds all who are falling and raises up all who are bowed down. So here it's better, the word shows it's better to bow down when we're facing trouble before the Lord and let the Lord raise us up and uphold us when we feel like we're slipping or falling instead of turning our back or lifting our chin in pride and rebellion to him. Let us be like those who are bowed down when we need help and the Lord will raise us up. The eyes of all look to you, and you give them their food in due season. You open your hand, you satisfy the desire of every living thing. The Lord is righteous in all his ways and kind in all his works. And I think of all of the animals through, throughout the earth, all the millions and billions of creatures that when they get their food and the cattle, they open their mouth to, to eat the grass, or eat the hay in the barn that's provided for them, the horses. I think of the Lord, his hand opening up the food to them because every creature gets its food in due season from the hand of the Lord. Amen. The Lord is near to all who call on him, to all who call on him in truth. He fulfills the desire of those who fear him. He also hears their cry and saves them. So be encouraged, those of you who fear the Lord and who call on him in truth, not in half-heartedness or not in deception, but you call on him facing the truth 
and in the fear of who he is and he will answer you and he will fulfill the desire that you have before him. The Lord preserves all who love him, but all the wicked he will destroy. My mouth will speak the praise of the Lord and let all flesh bless his holy name forever and ever. And so, Lord, we speak your praises tonight. We declare that you are worthy, that you are awesome, that you are good, that you are faithful, that you are wonderful, that you are majestic, that you are holy, that you are unchanging, that you are true, that you are light, that you are goodness. We lift your name high tonight and we bless your holy name. And we will do that forever and ever. Amen.